Hello and welcome to Unite and Prosper, where we will not be divided or conquered. And while you're watching this video, be sure to hit that like button, subscribe, and share, share, share. Today's subject is all about hiding the truth, which seems to be the number one thing these far-left Democrats do. Kamala has been accused of faking her attendance at rallies. I'm not sure if you've seen the photo of the plane with you know, no reflection of any of the people that were supposed to be there, calling it an AI crowd. <laughs> well, we'll get the photo here in a bit. And, but first, I want to remind you of the many times the Democrats and media have lied and hid from the American people the health of President Biden. Even Kamala, after the Biden-Trump debate, we're still defending and hiding Biden's health issues. Here's parts of an interview with Anderson Cooper, which surprised me as to how he drilled Kamala with this issue. I just wish that uh, him and the rest of the left-wing media would do that on every interview they do with the Democrats. Then maybe, you know, we'd have a little bit better government. <laughs> but I'm not going to bore you with the whole interview, but here are a couple of the segments that... Uh, sort of through my point. Some within your own party are, are wondering if President Biden should even step aside. What do you say to that? Listen, first of all, what we saw tonight is the president making a very clear contrast with Donald Trump on all of the issues that matter to the American people. Yes, there was a slow start, but it was a strong finish. And what became very clear through the course of the night is that Joe Biden is fighting on behalf of the American people on substance, on policy, on performance. And but that, I'm sorry, that on substance and policy and performance tonight, I mean, his, the president's performance tonight clearly was disappointing for his supporters. CNN is reporting Democratic lawmakers watching the debate were worried, uh, worried about the president's performance. One said it was a, a disaster. Another called it a train wreck. Those are Democrats especially worried that Biden did not punch back on Trump's lies. Uh, listen, people can debate on style points, but ultimately this election and who is the president of the United States has to be about substance. All about substance. <laughs> I wonder what substance she's on. <laughs> Even after 90 minutes of slaughtering that went on in that debate, she still dodges the truth. Wow. All right, move on. Nothing to see here. Please disperse. Nothing to see here. Please. Okay, here's the uh, photo I was telling you about. Of course, you got the plane right here. Kamala and... <laughs> I tell you, he, he looks like he should have a big red nose and big floppy shoes. And he's... <laughs> I don't know. Tim Washington reminds me of a clown. But anyway... uh See, all these people down here and what they're, this picture actually has a circled, uh, I, I would pay my attention more to over here because you can see the building here, which I guess the airport, pavement here, but no people standing anywhere. Okay. And even you know, zooming in, You know, you got nothing, you know, between, looks like the plane and the building, you see. There's no people in this reflection. Now, another photo. Once again, different angle further away. Do you see the silver part here? That silver part should be just like a mirror. You got all these people, okay? Now, you see what this shadow is? Which means we're in the shade. I'll get to that one in a second. See, so here's that shade. What would be the shade for the uh, reflection? So, in... I keep hitting the wrong one. There we go. In this one, okay, so you've got people in front. And people in the shade or under the shade, outside of the shade. Okay, no people in the shade, no people outside the shade. 
Okay, now. <clears throat> zooming in on this one. Like I was just showing you. See, this chrome should be just like a mirror. Just like a mirror. And once again, you see, because see how clear the white billing is on this compared to the blue part of the jet engine? Okay, I see that right there looks like one of them ladders you take up to the door. You know, so the, they can get out of the door here. It looks like what that might be in the back or background but side here. But there are no people. Once again, you see a shadow here. Well, I don't know if you can see the shadow on this one. No, you can't. That's the actual parking lot. Yeah, this is too far away to see the shadow. But anyway, there's no freaking people here. Okay, and to, um, I guess, defeat the debate of, well, look at the picture of the people on the moon. You don't see pictures of stars. Well, that's a totally different uh, subject, but now for this photo, here's a photo of a regular plane with actual people there. Okay, you got a person in an orange suit, person in a yellow suit. Okay, see right here. Where to go? Okay, I go. See, there's the yellow suit. No, that's the box. Let me zoom in here. It's easier to see if you zoom in. Okay, let's go. Okay, here we go. Okay, we got the orange suit here. There, his reflection is right there. Orange suit, orange suit. Yellow suit, right there's him, yellow suit. Okay, there's the two people. Right there and right there, you're seeing reflection. And of course, you've got yellow boxes below the engine. So there's the reflection of one of the yellow boxes. I would think it'd probably be this one. Let me zoom out a bit. And you got this right here, which is either these gas cans or this red backpack. I'm not sure which. It's looking like it's these gas cans. I can't tell if they're how far underneath the plane there are. The bottom line, okay, these people are about as close as these people are. And especially in this chrome part here, like I said, that chrome area of the jet engine could be just like a mirror. I mean, you ever seen a jet engine close up, the chrome part? Yeah, it's like a mirror. So there's no people in this parking lot. And with my eyes, anyway. But you can sure see them here. You've got, like I said, the guy in the orange is right here. The guy in the yellow is right there next to him. And like I said, the box right underneath, the yellow one. And you got the, either the gas can or the backpack, don't know which. And you can even see this little uh, luggage thing right here is right there. So there's the luggage rack. All right. So, you know, <laughs> you make your own choices, make your own decisions, you know, look, uh, you know, download, find these pictures somewhere, download them, and then just look at, uh, that's what I, basically what I did. I just found this somewhere on the internet. You know, I need to find an airplane with people next to it to see, you know, well, you can see these reflections. Why can't you see them here? You know, so, you know, you make your choice, you know, <laughs> that's up to you. So that is all for today. I sure hope you enjoyed it. And let me know in the comments what you think. Okay, I'd like to know what you think. I'm just giving you a perspective to look at. I'm saying, okay, this is what it looks like here. And this is what it looks like here. And I'll let you make your decision of what you think is really going on on, these, on this photo here. Because I, uh, I, I can't find it. I think about... I, Whenever Kamala went to Georgia in uh, the last week of June, I think, around June 20-something or 30th. But anyway, I, I ran over a video of some lady. She's a black lady. I hope that's not racist. I said black lady. Okay, some lady saying that um, she heard rumors about Kamala's team uh, paying homeless people and busting them to her rallies to have, you know, more people. And then she says she actually seen it whenever she was in Georgia or the rally she did in Georgia, like the last week of June. She actually seen it herself. She was actually busting, was actually busting homeless people 
to a, a rally. And uh, they get uh, paid for it. They get food. You know, middle of summertime, Georgia's pretty hot. You know, hot Atlanta. So it's pretty nice to be inside an air-conditioned, you know, gym or building for 90 minutes, sleeping and listening to her talk. Really, I can't find that video anywhere. I looked all back in my history of YouTube. I don't know, either YouTube took it down or the person that put it up took it down. But I can't find that video anywhere. But I have heard that uh, she's even been paying people to go to her rallies so she'd have more people. So, I don't know. That's another thing. I'm just letting you know what I've heard. <laughs> so, anyway, with that, I will let you go. I do appreciate your time watching my videos. Comment uh, in below and let me know what you think. And besides that, have a wonderful day.